Alexis and Hunter, the church shares your joy and warmly welcomes you together with your families and friends as today in the presence of God our Father, you establish between yourselves a lifelong partnership. My lover speaks. He says to me, arise my beloved, my dove, my beautiful one, and come. O oh, my dove, in the clefts of the rock, in the secret recesses of the cliff, let me see you, let me hear your voice. And over all of these, put love. That is the bond of perfection. And let the peace of Christ control your hearts, the peace in which you were also called in one body and be thankful. Now there were six stone water jars there for Jewish ceremonial washings, each holding 20 to 30 gallons. Jesus said to them, fill the jars with water. So they filled them to the brim. Then he told them, draw some out and take it to the head waiter. So they took it. And when the head waiter tasted the water that had become wine, without knowing where it came from, although the servants who had drawn the water knew, the head waiter called the bridegroom and said to him, everyone serves good wine first, and then when people have drunk freely, an inferior one. But you have kept the good wine until now. Jesus did this as the beginning of his signs in Cana in Galilee, and so revealed his glory, and his disciples began to believe in him. God, in his mysterious way, has once again brought two people together. They've come to know each other, they've fallen in love, and now they are ready to commit themselves to each other as husband and wife for the rest of their lives. It's amazing how that happens. The gospel for today is the wonderful passage from St. John, the wedding feast at Cana. Jesus chose a wedding party um, as the place to, to demonstrate his first great sign and to begin his public ministry. The young couple had run out of wine. The joy of the wedding celebration was going to be squashed. And Mary, the mother of Jesus, goes to him and says, they have no wine. That's all she had to say. And then he took over. He turned 180 gallons of water into the choicest of wine says an awful lot for a young couple beginning their married life. Ultimately, your own resources are going to run out. Your good looks, your beauty, your energy, your wealth, your health even, it happens to everyone. But by the grace of this sacrament, by the presence of the Lord Jesus at your wedding and in your home and in your lives, he will provide for you. And more than that, I think you will discover that as beautiful as your love is for each other today, as it was on Osaba Sound, as wonderful as all of that is, when it has been purified by sacrifice, tested by trial, in so many ways, it will become even more beautiful than that which you display today. That's a wonderful thing to hope for and to believe in. We are happy for you today, all of your friends and family who are here, and we ask God to give you many, many happy years together as husband and wife. And so in the presence of the church, I ask you to state your intentions. Alexis and Hunter, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I have. Are you prepared as you follow the path of marriage to love and honor each other for as long as you both shall live. I am. Are you prepared to accept children lovingly from God and to bring them up according to the law of Christ and his church? I am. Since it is your intention to enter the covenant of holy matrimony, I invite you to join your hands and declare your consent before God and his church. I, Hunter, take you Alexis. I, Hunter, take you, Alexis. For my lawful wife. For my lawful wife. 
to have and to hold to have and to hold from this day forward from this day forward for better for worse for better for worse for richer for poorer for richer for poorer in sickness and in health in sickness and in health to love and to cherish to love and to cherish until death do us part until death do us part i alexis take you hunter I, Alexis, take you, Hunter. For my lawful husband. For my lawful husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until death do us part. Until death do us part. May the Lord in his May the Lord in his kindness strengthen the consent you've declared before the church and graciously bring to fulfillment his blessing within you. What God joins together, let no one put asunder. May the Lord bless these rings that you will give to each other as a sign of your love and fidelity. Alexis, receive this ring. Alexis, receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Hunter, receive this ring. Hunter, receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. For Alexis and Hunter, and for their well-being as a family, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For their relatives and friends, and for all who have assisted Alexis and Hunter, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Let us humbly invoke by our prayers, dear brothers and sisters, God's blessing upon this bride and groom, that in his kindness he may favor with his help those on whom he has bestowed the sacrament of matrimony. In happiness may they praise you, O Lord. In sorrow may they seek you out. May they have the joy of your presence to assist them in their toil and know that you are near to comfort them in their need. Let them pray to you in the holy assembly and bear witness to you in the world. And after a happy old age, together with the circle of friends that surrounds them, may they come to the kingdom of heaven through Christ our Lord.
Mass is ended, go in peace. Thanks be to God. You may kiss the bride. I present Mr. and Mrs. Hunter Bowman.